Super Project. My project is based on SDG number 15, makes life online. So, many of the farmers face that which soil must be suitable for which type of crop. Also, they want to detect which type of soil is this and what is this texture. All this in one website. So, therefore, we made one website which integrates artificial intelligence which will detect all these things. So, it can be accessed by any of the devices whether it's laptop, desktop or mobile. So, this is my web AI in which I have included my artificial intelligence technology in my website which is stored in GitHub repository and I have included many informations and features in my website from various sources in internet and I have taken many informations of different type of soil, different textures of soil and also some samples of soil whether it's clay soil, loamy soil or sandy soil. Also, I have included many FAQs and a feedback form so that I could improve my web AI technology. So let's jump to my product where I have included my two type of detectors. First is soil type detector and second is soil texture detector. So let's, let's click on start button. So first of all, it takes some camera permission and we have to grant it. So now we have to place our camera in front of our soil. It can be any soil. Suppose I take a random soil. Um, so it's showing that it's 100, 99% to 100% sure that it is alluvial soil. And around uh, some probabilities are showing in clay and loamy soil both, which is correct information. And so it uh, says that my artificial intelligence technology is about 90% accurate. Therefore, it could help farmers to know which type of soil will be suitable for which type of uh, growing crop and also which is best. So, let's uh, see another problem faced by majority of farmers. So, the second problem faced by majority of the farmers is that how much water must be given to the specific crop in a specific amount. For example, if you grow maize crop, it requires 55% of amount of water. Therefore, it is mandatory to balance the maintenance of amount of water in the soil. So, we have created one Blink platform in an IIT, in an IIT platform where the percentage will be shown of the moisture, whether it's laptop or in mobile also. So, let's look upon on the mobile as it could be accessible by all the farmers. As you can see that now it is showing 51% of moisture level of our soil. We have used LED indications to indicate the moisture level. Now we will turn on the motor and water supply will be given. And now it will be automatically turned off as soon it will reach to its utmost. We can see that now the moisture percentage is now above 60%. So it will help the farmers to automate the process of irrigation and help them to give specific amount of water in that specific crop in specific amount. So now another problem arises. Let's look upon it. So the problem is that what if rain comes? No worry. We have a solution for this also. We have taken a rain sensor which will sense the rain and give notifications to the farmer. Let's take a raindrop and put it on our sensor. So we can see that our LED is glowing and also as well as notification has been shown and we can see all the notification histories in our no notification section so this our farmer could be notified and also motor can be turned off if it is on so therefore i want more and more feedback from the farmers to add more advanced feedbacks and more advanced ideas in my project group. so we have solved two major problems of the farmers with the advanced biotechnology. So I would like to thank you and have a great day ahead.